Munich is the capital of the German federal state of Bavaria and home to many world-class firms such as BMW. The city is also a major diversified financial hub. In fact, over 6% of all of the city's jobs are in this sector. Today, we are visiting Aquantum, a quantitative asset manager and specialist strategy provider that focuses on the development of systematic investment strategies with a focus on seasonal commodity spread trading. Their office is just a 10-minute walk from the main train station. In this video, you will learn why a quantum's systematic trading edge seasonality provides access to unique risk premia and is a consistent source of return, why a quantum's trading strategies are largely uncorrelated to all other asset classes, that seasonal patterns are systematically analyzed and traded at a quantum, and why model inherent risk management is a major performance factor. And finally, details about a quantum's team of experienced professionals, history, and organizational setup. Hello, Matthias. I'm Tom. Welcome to a quantum. Hi, Let's Tom. Let's see our offices in Munich. Thank you. First of all, here we have the trading floor. We'll meet the team in a minute. And further on here, we have all the server rooms. Right. Go. Cool. Let's have a word with everybody. This is the hub of a quantum. We have Fabian, Christian, Karina, and Andre. Fancy a coffee, an espresso, maybe? We have a really nice new coffee machine. Absolutely. Okay. Let's have sugar it. Or? Yes, okay. please. Great. So I'm now in the meeting room with the three partners of Aquantum. To my right is Thomas Morrow. He is the founder of the Aquantum Group and the chief investment officer. Then we have Karina Pulser, who is responsible for trading here in Munich. And then Christian Schneider, who is the COO. Tom, let's start with you. Tell us a bit about yourself and your company. Hi, I'm Thomas Morrow, Tom. I'm the founding partner of Aquantum and I'm responsible for research and trading. I've been creating numerous trading systems for more than 25 years for major banks, hedge funds, and more recently with Aquantum. And it's the area of seasonality trading, it's the one that I've found to have the most consistent results, statistically valid results with absolute returns that have largely no correlation with other markets and strategies. When I founded Aquantum in 2008, the initial products were in structured derivatives issued by banks. Aquantum launched its own funds and managed accounts in 2013, and Aquantum-owned products employ generally more complexity than most of the structured products, but the DNA is still the same. It's systematic seasonality trading, and we'll describe exactly what that is a bit later on. To achieve our corporate strategy, it's based on two major pillars. It's research and trading. And our core team consists of six seasoned professionals with successful track records in investment management and investment banking. Quantum is 100% principal owned and hence we're fully independent. So Tom, what distinguishes a quantum from other managers in this space? Trading seasonal anomalies is a well-known trading approach performed by several managers. Nevertheless, seasonality trading the way we perform it, via calendar spreads in a purely time-based and systematic way, is a pretty much unique approach in the asset management space, we believe. So Karina, let's put you on the hot seat now. Please tell us more about how the strategies actually work. Of course, Matthias. I'm Karina Polzer. I joined the Quantum in 2012 and became a partner in 2019. I head the portfolio management team here in Munich. As Tom already mentioned, our trading principles can be best described as systematic seasonality trading. But what's so special about that? Seasonality in commodity prices is a well-known phenomenon. 
However, our strategies aim to exploit seasonality in the commodity curves, not in outright commodity prices. Many years ago, Tom noticed that the commodity curves tend to move in a certain direction at certain times of the year. Further analysis showed then that these moves are not only statistically verifiable, they can be backed fundamentally. This means we do not simply trade statistical anomalies that appear in the data, we trade patterns that reoccur due to fundamental reasons. And these fundamental reasons can be summarized as changing expectations of market participants regarding supply and demand of a certain commodity. Market participants do have expectations about various factors that impact supply and or demand. For example, expectations about the weather, about crop yields, about the number the next storage report would reveal, or about future export and domestic demand. So, in simple terms, for our strategies to work, it doesn't matter if it is a warm or cold winter in general. What matters is if, when and how strong price expectations change, for example, based on a new weather forecast. The times when these changing expectations have the highest chance to move the curve in a certain direction is the time we place our trades. Therefore, our quantum strategies are time-based strategies. That means trades are purely based on the time of the year in anticipation that certain curve moves will occur and not in reaction to a price trigger. Due to the seasonal character of the patterns, it somehow seems logical to do this. However, at the same time, we consider this approach a major differentiator to others in the space. We implemented our strategies in a 100% systematic way. As we look for seasonality in the commodity curves, we also place every trade as a market neutral calendar spread and thus have no exposure to commodity spot prices. We further focus on the most liquid commodity futures markets as we consider high liquidity along the futures curves so in other words, we need more than one liquid contract to build a spread as a prerequisite for the seasonal patterns we aim to exploit. There are currently 24 markets that fulfill our liquidity requirements. Within this market universe, we identified many seasonal patterns and placed many trades simultaneously so that our programs are always broadly diversified. Our quantum offers currently two investment programs. The first one is the ACS program that was launched in 2013. ACS stands for a quantum commodity spread and trades commodity spreads from all sectors, so energies, livestock, grains, softs and metals. And the second one is the ACS energies program that, as the name says, purely focuses on the energy sector. It has been trading live since January 2017. The energy markets have monthly futures expiries and are very liquid along the curve. So there is a large number of trading opportunities for us and we are thus able to offer also portfolio for investors that want to avoid any agricultural exposure. Now, Corina, tell us also more about your risk management, please. Risk management is an integral part of our trading approach. Due to our time-based trading model, we are able to forecast which positions we will have on a certain day ahead of time. But what we do not know is the exact size of the trade in advance. However, to allocate the correct amount of risk is the key to get from a set of trading signals to a balanced portfolio with a certain risk return profile. The size of the positions depends on the market environment the trade is placed into. With market environment, we mainly mean the price of the futures contract at that time, the volatility of the spread, market and the portfolio, the shape and behavior of the curve. As these parameters change, the position size changes. Additionally, there are several stop levels and profit targets implemented for every spread, which are also volatility based. And finally, the overall portfolio exposure is controlled to a certain target volatility which is 10% per annum in the standard version of ACS and ACS energies. To prevent the model from leveraging up indefinitely in longer periods of low volatility, the model also features leverage caps at the spread, market and portfolio level. Now, how is daily trading of your strategies actually implemented at the Quantum? To answer that question and to show you how our daily operations look like, we would like to take you over to the trading floor now.
the Portfolio Management Team here in Munich takes care of everything that has to do with portfolio management and trading on a daily basis. So everything from running our model to generate signals, over order placement and execution, to trade allocation, reconciliation and reporting. Where possible and where we think this makes sense, these tasks are automated. For that purpose, we have developed a suite of systems and tools that are tailored to our current needs and can be adjusted and scaled to any future requirements. Additionally, there are also manual steps at various points within this process, as we consider a combination of automation and human support best suited for our trading approach. The order execution, for example, is always performed manually, as trading certain markets requires a lot of experience and sensitivity sometimes. Aside from the daily tasks, we spent most of our time doing research. And here I would like to hand over to Tom again. So Tom, a Quantum's research process is based on years of experience both in model development and trade execution. Can you briefly explain to us your research process, please? Quantum's research process is based on two pillars that complement each other. We distinguish between reactive and proactive research. Our reactive research employs extensive AI-based analysis tools to detect fatigue phenomena at an early stage. The use of AI enables us to quickly achieve more precise results and to reduce manpower in routine processes. Via our proactive research, we develop model improvements for ACS and ACS energies, and also work on new models, new strategies, within and outside our current market universe. This pillar of research also focuses on fundamental resilience. Of course, the use of the human factor is much more extensive in this area, because in this pillar, research is largely based on our expertise. Our AI applications on the reactive research side also generate trading suggestions. The quality of these trading suggestions is constantly increasing, due to an implemented learning process of our AI algorithm and extensive team guidance. The suggestions and ideas from both research pillars are extensively analysed before the research team finally decides on a potential implementation. Christian, can we briefly talk about the organisational structure of a quantum? Hi, I'm Christian Schneider. I'm responsible for client relations, risk, compliance and operations. I've been working in the financial industry for more than 20 years, many of them in investment banking and asset management. During this time, I've been involved in the structuring of various financial business startups and launch of investment products. I joined Aquantum in 2011. Aquantum has implemented an institutional asset management infrastructure for an international client base. This premise is based on three principles. First of all, we concentrate on things we have long-term experience in and are able to master, both professionally and operationally. And we cooperate with selected service providers for those areas that we do feel are more cost-efficiently outsourced. Secondly, we operate robust institutional IT systems and have implemented stable operational processes. Our IT environment is built on redundancy safety principles, including virtually real-time data backups and extensive emergency plans. Aquantum's virtualized IT infrastructure allows us to run business processes from anywhere in the world. This makes us largely independent of being all present in our Munich office. And thirdly, Aquantum is approved and licensed to operate in two major regulatory environments, the US and Europe. We are registered as a Commodity Trading Advisor, a CTA, and in parallel subject to the supervision of the European Financial Supervisory Regime, in our case, the German BaFin. Christian, in January of 2020, a quantum became a signatory of the internationally recognized Principles for Responsible Investments, or PRI. How is this consistent with trading commodity markets? We believe that it should be mandatory for a manager like us to consider ESG criteria. But we are aware of the major long-term challenges this process presents, 
especially as a provider of trading strategies largely implemented with derivatives in the commodities sector. Unfortunately, there is very little scientific analysis in implementing ESG criteria when using commodity derivatives in portfolio management. Only a joint initiative of international policymakers, investors and other market participants can create necessary ESG-compliant demand and supply chains in the commodity sector. We wish to actively promote this initiative. And finally, how can clients invest with a quantum and your strategies? A quantum offers the possibility to invest through funds and managed accounts. In the fund sector, we have solutions in Luxembourg and the Cayman Islands. For managed accounts, we can onboard almost any FCM. We also design individual structuring solutions in cooperation with our investors, either in terms of legal formats or in terms of the traded risk, which we can adapt to individual requirements. So Tom, Where can investors and interested parties view the success of your trading strategies? Well, Quantum is a very transparent investment house. For our trading programs, we publish performance data and related statistics every business day. These can be viewed on our website at quantumgroup.com. What should we expect to see next from the Quantum? In addition to the continuous development of our existing trading programs, The Quantum sees itself as a developer of unique systematic trading strategies, as well as bespoke solutions for investors and business partners. Process optimization and big data will play a decisive role in this. We always look forward to a dialogue with investors and partners and are also happy to set up video conferences. With our investment approach, we believe we can continue to deliver diversifying and unique absolute return solutions. Thanks, Matthias. It was great to meet you. And thank you for watching this video. We are looking forward to being in touch. Servus, ciao und goodbye.